So it's absolutely lovely to see you here tonight for Charlie and the Chocolate Factory and the theatre. What are you enjoying about tonight's production? Oh, well, what I will enjoy, I'm quite sure, is it all being revealed, I think. It's a, there's a lot of anticipation involved in doing a production like this, and we're just so happy to be here, and I'm looking forward to see. I saw little bits of the rehearsal, so now I'm really excited to see it all come together. How exciting is it to have a director like Sam Mendes on board? Extremely. Extremely exciting. I mean, uh, you know, you, 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 you want to feel like this is a really, really great children's book and you want to have a really, really, really great director. And that's Sam. Now, what do you remember most about it from your childhood, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory? What were your favourite memories of it? Oh, I think probably, uh, well, chocolate, it, for a start, was a favourite memory of childhood. And, um, and then, you know, the characters kind of came into our lives um, just because we read the book and sometimes we talk about them and sometimes we talk about, you know, different aspects of people's personalities uh, being like or not very like these different characters good and bad um, so yeah they I mean they, they were there so which were your favorite characters as a child and, and who did you like in yourself to in the story well you know I always like Grandpa Joe I don't know why I mean maybe probably because everyone everyone likens Willy Wonka with my dad and I think there are certain aspects of that but I also seem a bit like Grandpa Joe as well so I love Grandpa Joe I mean obviously Charlie but Grandpa Joe and what kind of memories would it bring back do you think for you tonight to the show well, you know, one of the memories, I was telling my sister today, one of the memories is that I came to the premiere of the, of the first movie in about 1971 or something like that, 72, and, and, and I remember that premiere, and that was as a young kid. So it's kind of wonderful to be here tonight and actually see it in its... Uh, I think it's a, a, a story that really will adapt well because it's so theatrical and musical already, and then you have it brought to life by these great talents. It's going to be magic. Why is it still so popular today? Because it's hugely popular with all generations, isn't it? <laughs> it? It is. I mean, I think like a lot of my dad's stories, it does that. It, like, it, it, it's, they're timeless and they're placeless in many ways, so that they appeal to all different uh, kinds of people across the spectrum. So, And they have all of the bits of uh, ingredients that you, you would think in, in any great story. They've got, you know, the wicked and the bad and the good and the underdog, but really, really felt, and they have chocolate.